uh, in Mobinet, uh, we are the, uh, we are designing and a hierarchical network as we face uh, the traffic is increasing uh, exponentially, such as uh, other um, uh, region of the world. Uh, here uh, 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 we define an hierarchical network. Uh, the level, the um, uh, end level is the access site. The access site is connected to hub site and uh, through um, uh, hub site connected to metro site. During um, um, uh, in the metro level, uh, we use uh, fiber optic to handle this uh, data explosion. The main challenges is um, uh, the location of the metro site and um, uh, the topology of this metro site. Uh, as I told you, this uh, metro site is the main site, main aggregation site in our networks. So main challenges is uh, leasing, building uh, this metro site, uh, and also uh, finding the fiber pass uh, to have uh, reliability and uh, enough capacity to transmit this traffic to core sites. Backhaul for mobile, band, mobile broadband network is uh, a bit different with GSM networks. So in these days, uh, we have a mixing uh, of uh, different technology. Uh, microwave technology uh, for access and hub site uh, and uh, data comm equipment on the uh, aggregation site on the uh, uh, metro site uh, to handle uh, uh, QoS feature, advanced QoS feature and uh, also synchronization features. Uh, as a um, uh, global trend, uh, LTE is the final uh, choice and best choice for all mobile operators, even uh, 2G mobile operator and uh, also WiMAX operator. Um, uh, global trend shows uh, uh, even WiMAX operator for 4G pass uh, selected LTE. Uh, I think that uh, the next 12 months, uh, most of the uh, current uh, 3G operator uh, also will upgrade the network uh, to LTE, uh, minimum as a trial version. Okay, that's very great. Uh, I'm fantastic. Uh, uh, most of my questions addressed, uh, addressed it during the panel discussion, mainly from security point of view and also how monetize LT and maximize it. Uh, very great, very great. I see a lot of people from around the world.